Hi everyone, my name is Connie Liu. I'm part of Texas Instruments High Speed Signal Conditioning Team. I'm the product marketing lead for our PCIe and USB segment of our portfolio. So today we have two main boards over here. Uh, the first board is our PCIe Signal Boost solution. So what we focus on is PCIe ReDriver based solution that is Intel common footprint that can be used across different platforms to really enhance your signal as you're uh, communicating between your CPU to your GPU or between two different CPUs or CPU to SSD. So, so it's boosting PCIe? Yes, it's boosting PCIe signal and it is protocol uh, agnostic so you can use it for PCIe or you can use it for CXL with no software requirements. Nice. And what's happening here? And then over here is actually used in uh, NVIDIA GB200 platform. Uh, we are part of the NVIDIA uh, reference design as the uh, uh, PCIe high-speed MUX, where you can MUX between two different sources um, as you select your endpoint, and also support different OCP multi-host uh, platforms. So you can uh, provide the equalization that you need as well as the high-speed muxing and demuxing. So is these solutions going to be in the middle of huge cloud computing servers or where, where is it going to be? So it typically sits either on the motherboard or on the riser car. And what are the other, what is this? So this one, it, uh, these are more uh, power solutions. Um, I might need my colleague yeah. to go over these. So you, you work only on those two? I, I mainly focus on these, and then we have another expert on our clocking-based solutions. All right. And what other things are happening in this area? Is it many, many different kind of products? So these, you can use it uh, very simply on the riser cards or you can build these in into like cables. So in enterprise, you can see a lot of MCIO cables, CDFE cables that require signal boosting. So you can add these chips to the cable to enhance uh, the cable length that you want to communicate your high-speed protocol. And what's the settings you can set here? As many different settings? These settings allow you to change different uh, CTLE, which is the equalization that you need. Um, and the DC gain settings that you have in your system that you need.